G'day guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, I thought I'll make this uh, quick video on the new Tello Ironman edition for those Tello owners out there that probably haven't heard about this already. Um, it seems to be a trending topic uh, online at the moment for the last two days and um, in all the Tello Facebook groups at the moment. So um, as you can see, I'm on the Rise Robotics website. I just thought I'll take a closer look at what they've got to say about this new Tello Iron Man edition and share it with you guys if you haven't seen it already. So um, as you can see, it looks pretty cool. It's in the uh, Iron Man armor uh, theme, so it looks pretty pretty awesome. So I'll just scroll down uh, the page here. As you can see, they've got a couple of videos on the new Tello. And here it goes on to say, They've got the um, Tello Hero app, which I've actually downloaded already and tried it out. And uh, it seems to me that it's a proprietary app for this specific Iron Man edition only. Um, I tried to hook up my original Tello. And um, you can sort of get into the app a little bit, uh, which I'll show you at the end of this video. I'll leave a, a screen recording in there so you can have a look at it yourself. But... Um, as far as I could get with the app itself, the new Tello Hero app, I can get up to the, the intro, obviously, and start the actual app running. And you can click that Terms and Agreements uh, checkbox, and then it will get you to connect to the Tello, and that's where it has a few problems with the, the original Tello. Um, as soon as you connect to the, the actual Wi-Fi of the Tello, the app sort of crashes, basically, and tells you that you're not connected when in actual fact you are connected to the Tello Wi-Fi. So it seems to me that they've made this proprietary um, and probably put a different Wi-Fi address or connection to this Iron Man uh, limited edition only, so you can't use it on the original Tello so far anyway, because it's only just been released. I think the app is in beta stages at the moment anyway. But as you can see, it goes on a bit more information programmable fun, intelligent flight modes. From what I've seen so far, um, the layout of the app is very similar to the original Rise Tello app, uh, except it's got that uh, Iron Man design interface. So here's a couple of other photos here on the website here, guys, on the Rise Robotics website. As you can see, it looks pretty cool. You've got the Iron Man designed armor library all throughout this uh, model. You've got gold motors, color-coded uh, props and everything like that with the gold and uh, burgundy accents. And you've got that, uh, that arc reactor on top. It would be pretty cool that um, if, you can, if they've incorporated an LED in this uh, arc reactor, that would be pretty awesome. I'm not too sure if it's just printed on, but if they incorporated an LED, that would be pretty awesome, guys. So I'll just um, scroll a bit. Further down, as you can see, there's the app layout there, guys. All the icons on the top look very similar to the original app, the Rise Tello app, but they've reworked the whole interface for this um, Iron Man Tello edition. Um, also, it goes on to say here that you'll hear the voiceover of Iron Man's AI assistant throughout the app, which I'll show you at the end of this video as well, in the screen recording that I took last night of uh, Friday talking to you, so that's rather cool as well. And um, there's another video there as well. So, um, yeah, I mean, this has just been released, guys, in the last couple of days. And, um, yeah, the price of it, um, I believe it's $129 compared to the $99 of the original. So be prepared to pay $30 more for this new version. And I think they've incorporated this where you can, as you can see here, it's got a programming simulator on the app, the new app. And it, support, it tells you here it supports the Tello EDU, which I'm familiar with. I've tried Tello EDU out. And the Swift Playgrounds app, which I'm not familiar with. So it looks like you can program the, the Tello to do uh, certain things throughout the app. And uh, I think there's a couple of missions that you can do with Friday uh, telling, walking you through some missions as well. So I think they've this new Tello Hero app, they've incorporated like a, 
a Marvel video game of sorts. So that's pretty cool. Looks pretty interesting so far. I'll click on buy it now. And as you can see, once I go into that, it's not available in Australia yet. So it's just been released. So I'm not too sure if it's available everywhere or just in Australia as yet. So uh, you will probably have to wait a little while before it's officially released. So anyway guys, uh, I just thought I'll make this quick video. I'll um, show you the Play Store screen recording that I've done. Um, it looks like it's in the beta mode at the moment guys. And um, towards the end of this video, I'll show you a little bit of a glimpse of the actual app itself once I opened it up on my Android phone and tried to connect to it with uh, and failed. So. Um, it didn't it didn't work guys on the original tello so anyway guys um just thought i'd make this quick video on the new tello iron man edition for you guys that haven't heard about it already so feel free to um comment like and subscribe and i'll catch you on the next video until then happy flying Recruit, I am Friday, Tony Stark's AI assistant. Congratulations on your induction into the pilot program and being entrusted with one of Stark Industries' latest mini drones. We have detected some hostile forces in your area, and Iron Man needs your help. As a rookie pilot, you will learn to master the technological capabilities of your drone and harness the skills necessary to survey and protect your neighborhood. This drone is equipped with turbo quad rotors high-res camera, onboard flight radar, and a missile evasion system. Now I will guide you on how to control your drone through a series of training missions. Let's begin by establishing a connection with your drone. Quite the size of everyone else. So you're saying Ant-Man is an powerful adventure? What you have to understand is that Hulk's power is infinite. The matter he gets, the more powerful he becomes. That's why he's the... I don't know. 